Today is a leg day. I'm starting to feel a little bit queasy. He wasn't ready. It was brutal for me. This was upstairs and I was like, I gotta throw this on. It's so cold. Going potty is a little bit different at the new house, huh, sweetie? You good? Okay, come on. Lulu, it's freezing out. All right, first morning in the new house. A little bit of a walk to get to the grass for the dogs in the morning. Oh, the feet, so cold. Oh, back in the warm. All right, it's a leg day. I gotta head over to the gym, but I need to stop and get something to eat first. I don't have any food here, so it'll be a quick stop and then leg day. I also, also want to try vlogging on my ZV-1 today. Morgan has a ZV-2. I'll try vlogging on the ZV-1, see how we like that compared to the iPhone. So here we go. I do feel very fortunate that I can show up every single morning, get a good workout, and just get after it, start the day off right. Having more of an attitude of gratitude. Warm up for a leg day is always a little bit longer. Mobility routine plus an active warm up. Starting off with some foam rolling, get the hips open, and then add a little active warm up. All of this stuff, too. We have an in the app. I am following the Swole program. My goal for the next, I would say, 10 to 12 weeks, I need to actually set a hard and fast goal, but let's say the next 12 weeks for me to get big, to get Swole. So, on that Swole program, which is a five day a week split, big fan of it as I'm able to target like my, my weak areas. I'm training, you know, the muscle groups, chest and back twice a week. And so we should probably go in and get body fat tested and everything. Not as a way to get leaner, but it has actually a way to maintain a level of leanness as we increase size. So goal will be to gain, I would say about a half a pound a week. So that would put me at, I don't know, goal is to gain about a pound a week. A pound, a, no, not a pound a week. No, 12 weeks, 12 pounds, yeah, about a pound a week. Let's see if we can do it. Let's, a, let's appreciate the snow here in St. George for a minute. I did not know there was snow on these mountains when I was driving because it was dark. Look at that. Would you look at that? Still not a very good shot, but that's pretty cool. Back in fitness culture today. Today is a leg day. I'm actually giving these shoes. These, this is not a shout out. These are the Vivo Barefoot Men's. Morgan got me for Christmas. So we're gonna see how they perform today in a leg workout. I'm gonna give a good warm up. I'm just gonna be following the app today. All of this is in our fitness culture app. So I'm gonna jump right into it with some mobility. jumping into this workout. This was upstairs and I was like, I gotta throw this on. Who thinks we should start selling these at the front desk again? A little old school Swole Nation merch. Let's get it going. Why not? Why not? So my first exercise is actually gonna be a little bit different than what's on the app. I'm still calling it part of my warm up, but hip thrust machine. And the only reason I love it, it's the glutes going. We got front squats today. And again, my quads love taking over. So if I can make sure I'm activating my glutes, we can get that almost that mind muscle connection, put the stress in the glutes rather than really focusing on, you know, the lower back. The hip should be nice and warm. Turn on the glutes and then get into it. In here and again this is just more for me because i have such tight hips and underactive glutes that in order for me to stay healthy i have to do this extra glute work to make sure a that i keep mobile hips but then also i'm turning on the big prime movers today rather than having those little erector muscles in my back taking over All right, so front squats today. Keeping that torso nice and upright, crack the knees, and we're squatting up hot. We got two minute rest in between this. My reps are looking 10, eight, six, 10, eight, six, four. 
get pretty heavy here. Belt as tight as it goes. I'm basically like sophomore in high school Steve right now. Freaking lightweight. I weigh about the same too. Need to get to like 225. Get to 225 at 5%, like my dad used to say. Steve, if you could do this, if you could run, you're a 400, a 12 year old old, in one minute and 40 seconds, they'll be writing songs about you. All right, up next, we've got a little super set. We go hack squat and then a calf raise. I have rep wise today on the fitness culture app. We got 12, 10, 8, 6, getting heavier. And then on the toe raises, four sets of 10. All right, now we got those quads a little wobbly. We're gonna do a single leg off the box squat. Because we're nice and tired, I might even have to use the ground as a little bit of momentum, but essentially we're just working on one leg, the one that's up on the box, standing up, coming down, trying to not that, let that knee cave in too much. It's gonna wanna go in a little bit, but what we wanna do is keep that leg independent. If you need to touch the ground, use, use this as an eccentric touch and come up. Long hours, long showers, showing up the parties after hours, don't get devoured. Working like I got superpowers, my weed sweet, but my lady sour burn the flowers. Let's just, let's just admit right now, training legs sucks out any kind of upper body pump that you might have had yesterday. If we show a video clip from yesterday's back day to today. I look like a string bing, which is my point of why I usually wear long sleeves on a leg day, because you just don't look juicy. This is Alex, waiting for me to get ready to do my last set here, and me, dying. I'm dying, Alex. It's as much hype as you got for me. You got this. In the most monotone English voice you've ever heard. That's what you need. <laughs> you got this. Starting to feel a little bit queasy. Unfortunately, we got the worst, hardest exercise for last. It's a Bulgarian one and one quarter split squat, so. No! We have 10 reps on this first one, but our rep consists of all the way down, up a quarter, all the way up. That's one rep. The memory capacity of the human brain is testified to have equal 2.5 petabytes of memory capacity. A petabyte. One million gigabytes. My lord, my battery just got another charge. The way I connect to the gang, got them wired. 2020 vision, I can see your farces. Yeah, sour taste in your mouth like sour. Please don't get back door, cause you left in a jar. Just say you sorry, ain't gonna stress it no more. Soon as green get in between, don't text me no more. I'm fine. That is it. Leg day. Done and dusted. Oh, I do have my mobility work to go do. So I might go over there, lay down for 10 minutes. It's like that's first leg day. Obviously, first real leg day, did heavy back squats and then just everything else kind of compounded on itself. He wasn't ready. She wasn't ready. It was brutal for me. So gonna get better, gonna get stronger. 12 weeks, 12 pounds, here we go. Appreciate you guys watching these. Appreciate you guys seeing me in pain and then thinking to yourselves, yeah, I'm gonna go do that workout. I, I, I can, that's courage, that's courage. Go get it done. Man, I remember when I used to be fit. Now I'm just like hot girl fit, like Instagram girl fit, or guy, I guess for that matter. Where they look like they're fit, but they're not really fit. That's me right now. 2024, the goal is to not be hot girl fit. Ah, I'm smiling but crying inside, so. I'm gonna stretch out here, and then we got to finish moving the house. It's snowed this morning, it's cold outside, but the best part is, is the day looks so much nicer now that legs are done. Ending the vlog tonight, 10.30. Ending it in the fridge. A, it gives off a nice little lighting effect. B, this is where I am going to now focus. As we get these workouts nailed down, you gotta focus on what you're putting into your body. If you're gonna be making changes, oh, come on. Hey, technically you do work for me. Come on, fridge. We're beeping here. We're gonna be make substantial change to the physique, the schedule of 
eating, for me, I like doing it on a routine. I like knowing basically uh, I'm gonna eat four meals a day and two snacks. That's always kind of been it for me. And if I can get my protein, my 220 to 230 grams protein, my 300 to 350 grams carb, and then 65 to 75 grams fat. Maybe I'll bump that up a little bit, see how, was, how it goes with, with the weight. Probably will go up to about 85 grams fat. But scheduling it out, having a plan, makes then my life so much easier, makes the training worthwhile. And I even feel like I start seeing the changes. You know, like I can go work out, but if I'm not, if I'm not eating right, doesn't matter. But once I start eating right, I can see those changes happening a lot faster. So we'll talk about more on this on the next vlog. As of right now, I am going to bed and hopefully get a solid eight hours. Mm -hmm.